Hi everyone, my name's Manny, Product Spokesman of the UK at Xiaomi Global. It's a pleasure to be here today. A very warm welcome to all our media friends, me fans and partners and everyone else watching the live stream. So we're all going through difficult times with the pandemic, but I just want to say that we're all in this together. Xiaomi is helping counter the COVID-19 pandemic by sending tens of thousands of face masks to NHS. The donation is going to help ease the shortage of personal protective equipment. And we're sending crates out to different parts of the world which have special messages just like this one from Charles Dickens. Xiaomi was founded just over nine years ago, which makes us a very young technology company. And we were founded with a purpose of innovation for everyone. On the 22nd of July, 2019, Xiaomi joined the Fortune Global 500, which is a huge milestone for us. In Q1 2020, Xiaomi ranked fourth globally for smartphone shipments with 9% growth year on year. But we couldn't do any of this without the support of our Mi fans, which we're truly grateful for. So we just want to take this opportunity to say thank you to all our Mi fans out there. Xiaomi's four key pillars are innovation, design, quality, and value for money. And you can see each of these principles in every one of our legendary Redmi Note series phones. Let's take a look. Okay team, we're fast approaching the launch of our Redmi Note 7. We need from the operations team to refine our simulations and technical team, let's begin work on our custom rig. Flight path predictions are on course for a launch this week. It'll be traveling up to about 30 kilometers over the course of two hours. It's gonna be minus 60 at peak altitude, so let's hope that phone survives. Tracking team, are we good to go? Check. Air traffic control, are we go for launch? We are all clear. OK, ground team, we are ready for launch. Release in five, four, three, two, one. Go for launch. Balloons burst, 35 kilometers, that's descending. Payload's now at 15 kilometers. We need to change course. Uh, it's coming down near Peterborough. We've got five minutes till touchdown. Let's go. Should be around here somewhere. There it is. Everything is functioning perfectly. Pretty good for a trip to space and back. Life is full of challenges. You never know what's going to happen next. Yesterday, I was at home in Brisbane. Yeah, this trip has been pretty crazy. I had to get here pretty much in 24 hours. Now, I'm here at the edge of the world in Antarctica. Armed with little more than the clothes on my back, and my Redmi Note 8. My name is Jackson Chang. I'm a photographer and a filmmaker. I'm constantly looking for ways to challenge myself by taking on new and exciting projects. 
I was inspired by the Redmi Note 7 Space Challenge last year. So when Xiaomi came calling about doing something for the Redmi Note 8, I jumped at the challenge. Times like these can make you doubt your decisions. From freezing cold, high speed winds, and massive rolling waves, it has been hard to keep my footing. Let alone capture great shots with my phone. The blistering cold makes the body start to shut down. And living in a confined space for weeks with nearly no outside contact is a true test of will. But you know what? If you wait for the perfect moment, the moment may never come. You only live once. Why not grab the challenge with both hands and see where it takes you? Face your challenges head on. This is a shot. Create something new. Embrace the unpredictable. Let your curiosity drive you further than you ever imagined. This is incredible. When you make up your mind, nothing can stand in your way. With the Redmi Note 8, capture so much more than you ever thought possible. Redmi Note 8 will live for the challenge. The Redmi Note series brings some of the most incredible mid-range smartphones in the market. There are over 110 million Redmi Notes chosen across the globe. And we've had great success with the Redmi Note 8 series. 30 million units were sold worldwide. And the legend continues as we bring yet another incredible series. Today we have two amazing products for everyone, so let's just get started. The Redmi Note 9 Pro offers a flagship design with two-tone colours that appeal to a wide audience. You've also got beautiful symmetry which makes it easy to hold in one hand and you've got a choice of colours available. The three different colours include interstellar grey, tropical green and glacier white. The Redmi Note 9 Pro offers a 6.67 inch dot drop display which offers vivid detail and true to nature colour. It also has an aspect ratio of 20 by 9, which means the screen goes right to the edges, which makes it ideal, especially when you're watching movies or even gaming. TUV Ryland are a German organisation that certify the safety of our screens and help with filtering out blue light, flicker and also reflection when using the phone in direct sunlight. It also gives us a gentler viewing experience. Corning Gorilla Glass on the front and back makes it a very durable device. People unlock their phone over a hundred times in a day and want to offer the best experience possible. The Redmi Note 9 Pro has a side mounted fingerprint reader which doubles up as a power button. So let's take a look at the cameras. There are four of them which are made up of the 64 megapixel which is your primary lens. You've got your ultra wide angle lens, macro and depth of field. Now the 64 megapixel has a large image sensor that collects more light, which is ideal for low light situations, but also captures more details, which is perfect, especially with people that want to print pictures, you can do so for up to 3.26 meters. Let's take a look at some of the images the 64 megapixel can offer our Mi fans.
The 8 megapixel ultra wide angle lens gives you 119 degrees field of view, which means you can fit more in the frame. For those of you who want to take your photos to the next level, we have portrait mode, which offers the blurred background effect, creating that professional looking photo. But if you want to become a true pro, you've got the cinematic portrait mode, which allows you to have an aspect ratio of 2.39 to 1, which creates the black bars on either side of the screen. Can you guess what this is? These are bubbles on a bottle of cola that have been shot in macro mode. And you can now shoot in RAW, which allows you to adjust the colors and give the exact image that you want. The Redmi Note 9 Pro has amazing video features, of which includes smooth zoom, which allows you to focus on what you want. It also has auto exposure and auto focus to help. I think you'll really enjoy these videos. The last video was recorded in super high definition, 4K. But if you want to get really creative, you've got six kaleidoscope options, so you can play with the video even more. Now check this out. We mustn't forget the front camera, which offers automatic scene recognition, panorama selfie, and super slow motion videos. This is the first Redmi series to offer a Qualcomm Snapdragon 700 series chipset, which is ideal for gamers, as it offers better performance and lower power consumption when you're on the go. We're particularly proud of our battery, which is a 5,020 milliamp, which gets you around two days of use. Every unit has a 33 watt fast charge in the box. You can charge zero to 50% just in 30 minutes. As you can see, we stand out from the crowd. Let's talk about haptic feedback. The Z axis linear motor has 120 different effects. This means you have different feedback when you're typing, receiving notification or unlocking your phone. We should quickly talk about our MIMO Wi-Fi, which gives you better signal and better coverage as well. And it goes without saying, our phones are equipped with NFC.
quick recap on the Redmi Note 9 Pro's key features, of which include a powerful processor, a huge battery, haptic feedback options, and stunning movie and photo tools as well. As you can see, our Redmi Note 9 Pro pricing is extremely competitive, giving our Mi fans an incredible feature set in an elegant device that fits in with their lifestyle. And now, onto the Note 9. the Redmi Note 9, and again, it has a hotshot design, which is sleek and very stylish. The screen size is 6.53 inch and has a small camera, which means you've got more screen space for what you want to do. A little more on the look. The rear fingerprint sensor blends into the back of the phone. There are three colors available, forest green, polar white, and midnight gray. The Redmi Note 9 also has four cameras, a 48 megapixel primary lens, an ultra wide angle, a depth sensor and a macro lens as well. Let's take a look at some of the photos. That small front facing camera is 13 megapixel and supports portrait and panorama selfies. And it also has face unlocking. I'm pleased to announce our global debut of the MediaTek Helio G85 chipset, which is ideal for everyday gamers. And also the Redmi Note 9 has a huge 5020 milliamp battery and provided a 22.5 watt fast charger in the box. And once more, NFC. <laughs> So, the Redmi Note 9 has some amazing features, including a huge battery, high performance chip, and cameras for every situation. Once more, you see our Note 9 pricing is very competitive, giving our Mi fans fantastic features in a powerful device. Our new phones are all available later this month with the 64 gigabyte Note 9 Pro on pre-sale today via Amazon. The 128 GB model will then be available from Amazon and me.com from the 19th of June. And the 64 and 128 GB versions of the Note 9 will be available towards the end of the month. And here is the Redmi Note 9 series, which includes the Redmi Note 9S, which has a 6.67 inch display and a 20 by 9 aspect ratio, meaning you can see a lot more on the screen. It also has a 48 megapixel quad camera, a Snapdragon 720G processor, and it also supports 18 watt fast charge. We now have an unboxing video for those of you who are interested. Hi guys, it's ASBYT, and these two phones are the next in line of the hugely popular Redmi Note series of phones. We've got the Redmi Note 9 and the Redmi Note 9 Pro. 
This unboxing and first look video is following on from the launch product demo, so you can get a real sense of what the device would be like to purchase and own yourself. So this parcel arrived from Xiaomi, who in case you didn't know, created the sub-brand Redmi as a way to bring great budget and mid-range devices to market. Inside the large box were two smaller boxes containing two very such devices, the Redmi Note 9 in midnight gray, which has a maximum of four gigabytes of RAM and 128 gigabytes of storage, and the Note 9 Pro in interstellar gray, which has a maximum of six gigabytes of RAM and 128 gigabytes of storage. Both of course have expandable storage using a micro SD card. These two devices sit either side of the Note 9 S, which I reviewed a couple of weeks ago, with the Note 9 being described as everything you need, the 9S being the performance star, and the Note 9 Pro being flagship inspired. So if we lift the lids, you get an identical unboxing experience with both. We get the manuals and soft cases first, before we're greeted with the actual phones. And finally, when we move those to one side, we get the charger and charging cables. So straight away, looking at the design of the two, they are very, very similar. But there are a few key differences as well. Both have the Redmi logo at the bottom, and both have a quad camera setup. More on the differences and performance of those later. You will notice the LED flashes are in different positions and underneath the camera on the standard Note 9, we have a fingerprint scanner where we don't on the Pro because it's housed on the power button on the side under the volume rocker. IR blasters on the top, dual SIM card trays on the other side with the speaker grills, Type-C charging ports and headphone jacks all in the same position on the bottom. Yes, that's right, we have headphone jacks. Now the Note 9 Pro has Gorilla Glass 5 construction on both the rear and front display panel. The standard Note 9 also shares the GG5 front, but has a slightly less premium construction elsewhere. We have a full screen, full HD plus LCD display on both, 6.53 inches on the standard and a larger 6.67 inches on the Pro. The only real difference on the front is the fact we have a 30 megapixel front facing camera at the top left hand side on the Note 9 and a 16 megapixel camera in the center on the Pro. Now, as we've touched briefly on camera, let's dissect the quad camera on the rear, starting with the standard Note 9. We have a 48 megapixel primary sensor with f1.8 aperture, an 8 megapixel ultra wide angle lens with f2.2 aperture, a 2 megapixel f2.4 macro lens, and a 2 megapixel f2.4 depth sensor as well. If we jump to the Pro, as stated, we do have a quad camera setup as well, but we have a 64 megapixel f1.9 aperture primary lens, an 8 megapixel f2.2 aperture ultra wide angle lens, a 5 megapixel macro lens with f2.4 aperture, and a 2 megapixel f2.4 aperture depth sensor as well. So you do get a slight upgrade with the Pro model in the camera department, and you also get it in video recording as well. 1080p at 30 frames a second on the front facing camera on both, but on the rear we do get that upgrade. So we get 4K at 30 frames a second on the rear here and 1080p 60 frames a second as well. Whereas on the standard Note 9, we just get the 1080p at 30 frames a second max. Now, one huge selling point of the Redmi Note 9 series is of course battery. We've got a whopping 5,020 mAh cell on both. And we also get fast charging on both, but we do get the superior 30 watts fast charging on the Pro compared to the 18 watts fast charging on the standard. The Pro also has a superior chipset running with the Qualcomm Snapdragon 720G compared to the standard Note 9, which runs off the MediaTek Helio G85. The 720G is one of the latest 700 series chips from Qualcomm, offering great performance for the price, and the G stands for gaming, which aids that sentiment. The phone's performance is also aided by fluid software with Xiaomi's MIUI 11 skin running over the top of Android 10. NFC is also available on both as well, so if you're a fan of mobile payments, then that's gonna be great for you. And of course, one of the biggest selling points of the Redmi Note series is price. So what do these two retail for? Well, the starting price for the standard Note 9 is just £180, £250 for the Pro model. And considering you get that quad camera setup, a whopping 5,020 mAh battery, a full screen display and capable chipsets, I feel Xiaomi have really hit that great value for money mark again. Thanks for watching. I've been ASBYT. Enjoy the rest of the launch. So now I'm going to answer some of your questions. Can you really focus on the specs and give us the technical details on things like the camera? 
Absolutely. So both smartphones have got higher megapixel lenses, which captures more information. And especially the Pro has got the 64 megapixel lens with a large image sensor that collects more light, which makes it ideal for low light scenarios. Question number two. What type of scenes does the Redmi Note 9 Pro camera recognize? A great question. So it recognizes things such as sunset, plant, trees, animals, and people as well, which makes it easy for you to take the perfect photo every single time. Question number three. What two features make the Redmi Note 9 Pro stand out from the competition? Again, another good question. So the two features that really kind of stand out include the big battery, 5,020 milliamp, and also the super fast charge. So both phones will keep up with your lifestyle. Now competition time. I have three questions about our new Redmi Note 9 series phones. Type your answers as quick as you can. The fastest correct answers win prizes. So get ready. How many haptic effects are available? What are the color options for our phones? Which two companies manufacture the high performance chips on these two phones? Thank you for joining me to learn about the new Redmi Note 9 series.